airbags. The idea of using a giant balloon to cushion you if you crash has been around since the 1950s, yet it wasn't until 1974 that General Motors offered the first commercial car with a driver's side airbag. Today, all new American cars and 91% of all new European cars are fitted with airbags. Your driver airbag works in a very similar way to a rocket. They both use solid fuel. In your car, this is found in a compartment behind the steering wheel, like this. When it's ignited, it's contained and the gases released inflate the airbag. Whereas with a rocket, the solid fuel is at the bottom. So when you ignite it, the uncontained release of energy propels the rocket skyward. The gas blows up the airbag pretty quickly, so we're going to film this test rig to show you just how fast it inflates. That yellow weight up there simulates somebody's chest. Now, as it's dropped, it will pass this sensor, which will activate the airbag to inflate in time to cushion its fall. Well, Rick, that happened so quickly. What speed was that? The airbag's inflated in roughly 35 milliseconds, which, to scale it for you, it takes you approximately 200 milliseconds to blink. Wow. Which is pretty Now, quick. that's why I didn't see it. Yeah. <laughs> you don't need to worry about suddenly being hit by an airbag because a sensor in your car continually measures acceleration and deceleration. It'll only deploy the airbag when it senses a dramatic deceleration resulting from a sudden impact and the bags themselves are getting clever. They can now alter the amount they inflate according to the weight and position of the person, which means they're less likely to give you a hard punch in the face. Now check this jacket out. It can surround you in airbags. It's already being used by some of the police riders in Japan, Spain and Brazil. And the idea is that if you're on your motorbike and you get thrown off, this tag gets pulled, the jacket inflates and it can soften your fall. Now, it needs a damn good pull. Darren, if you could. Now, it improves your safety, and it's pretty damn sexy, too. In today's cars, airbags can be in the roof, in the side, in your seat. There are even airbags to put you in the right position before you hit another airbag. But wherever they are, an airbag will always react so quickly that if you blink, you'll miss it.